So, this is a new thing. <laughs> hey, welcome to Robuff Productions, my YouTube channel. It's hmm, been, I don't know, six months since I posted my first video, which is the ARC 170. But, six months ago, never thought I'd be talking in my videos. Because of the whole situation on my other channel, but let's not, not off topic. But welcome back to another video. Today we are reviewing the Luke's Land Speeder, the Obi Wan, and the Obi Wan Hut. Here, well, let's do the figures last. Here, you know, best for last. So, so, so. so we're going to be focusing on Luke's Land Speeder first, and I do have a squeaky chair. That's what the sound is. That's what that is. It's my squeaky chair. Let's do Luke's Land Speeder first. So. I have a tripod set up for the camera now instead of it just me holding it. So, lens beater, front view, side view, back view, side. And the top view has a little steering wheel and a sticker there. It's a little dusty because I've had this set for a little while. But, um, yeah, you see the sticker there. And if you pull this piece back, pull this up, go into the lightsaber handle, and well, I put that in there. So binoculars and a poncho for Luke. I'll show you what that looks like on Luke after this. That's about it for the line speeder. The bottom has these clear dishes, so that way it can move around easier. And the seats can fold down and up. Steering wheel obviously turns, and it comes with a little gun on the side that Luke can hold. Now Obi Wan Hut. Oh wait, one more thing. This also came with the land speeder. It's a little Jawa hut. One of the huts, a little cave for the Jawa. Inside the land speeder. Now let's go to Obi Wan's hut. So what I did is kind of just added my own little. Uh, the drone piece here, the remote. I kind of added my own the remote on top. Inside the box is just some binoculars. That's about it. Let's close this up. Put this back. And the feature on this set is that it can open up the sides, and the top can open all the way like that. And it comes with a nice little princess. <clears throat> Comes with a nice little Princess Leia here. Little hologram Princess Leia. But, um, now back to the hut. Put her, actually, keep her out. So, back here, we kind of have a bamp, the uh, gaffy stick. So, a little stove top here. I don't know where the pot is, it's somewhere in here. And we have some blue milk and a cup. Back there, kind of a C-3PO, where I put C-3PO. The hologram table where Princess Leia would sit. The little shelf with a nice gray skeleton leg. A white stud. And some kind of bottle here. That's that side. And on this side, whoops. We have a crate. A piece of pipe or something. Inside the crate, there's nothing because everything's out of the crate currently being used. On other mocks, if you guys, well, you guys probably saw the Mustafar kind of higher on scene, but that's about it for that. Now, let's actually let's grab the figures now. All right, so here we have the figures. So I'm going to be going off the Obi Wan's Hut figures first, and then the Luke's Lion Speeder figures. So this is the figures. These are the figures <coughs> for Obi-Wan's hut. Of course, Obi-Wan. Focus, camera. Nice Obi-Wan figure. And this torso would be good for a Uncle Owen. I mean, if I didn't have, an, if I had another one. <clears throat> and I had two Lukes, but I gave one to my cousins because I don't really need two different Lukes. <laughs> so here we have Luke Skywalker, which has a double face. Obi-Wan does not. That face looks like nice back printing, some leg printing there. Come on, camera! Come on, camera! There you go. <clears throat> this is only gonna be a little longer, videos. and of course, 
R2, whose line is kind of wonky. Come on. His little... Come on, camera. His line's a little bit wonky, but it's better than the other R2s I have. But his legs can move, because it, you know, all astromech joints. Okay, now let's move on to the Luke's Land Speeder figures. We have a <clears throat> we have a Jawa. Nice front printing, some back printing there. We have C three PO. There's nice little eyes there. Fun fact: this is my first ever C three PO figure in my entire leg up collection, which is quite surprising, honestly. Back printing there. Leg printing. It's sad that the leg isn't dual molded. That is quite the complaint in the Lego community. Well, some people like it, some people don't. I am one of the people that don't and wish it was dual molded. And of course, it wouldn't be Luke's Land Speeder without Luke Skywalker. Now, this is the figure I just showed you, so I'm not going to make much of a figure on it. <clears throat> but that is about it for the video. That is about it for the video. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye bye.